Hi again, you're with us on Great Expectations. And today, as you can see, is our how-to show. And we're in our demo kitchen, my favorite place, with the ever yummy mommy chef, Yudika Sajnani. So how do we bring romance into the kitchen with as little effort as possible? It doesn't have to be Just, sweat and tears. No, no, it doesn't. Okay. The first thing I want to say is Happy Valentine's Day. Oh, and I brought thank you. It's my first gift for today. Thank you. It's uh, something you need for the kitchen. I always say a shower cap. It's a shower cap. Keeps your hair from getting smelly in the kitchen, ladies. Okay. Um, but the simple ingredients, a well-stocked pantry. Yes. Always a good idea because you can just get in there, pick a few ingredients and add flavor to really simple foods. Okay, all right. Okay, so, so we're going to be doing three dishes today. So for somebody who has no clue yet about what they're going to be doing for their man, give us some idea. Lay out a menu for us. Okay, so we're going to be doing prawns, which you can serve as a snack, okay. a starter or a main. Okay. I really believe on Valentine's Day, it's not the day to be eating big plates of food. Little plates, okay. you don't want to be over I know, full. you've tried to squeeze into that dress. Yes. Not you, somebody else has tried to <laughs> squeeze into squeezing. that dress. You're all squeezing into that dress, okay. But also, when you have a very heavy meal, you sort of like all your energy okay. goes to, to digesting your food. Okay. And then you don't really have, okay. uh, you, you don't really feel like chatting, you just want to hit the sack, so. No. Okay, so we've got the prawns here. We've got the prawns. All right, what, what prawns do we have here? They're the we've black-tailed got, ones. Yeah, these are black-tailed prawns. Um, we've shelled and deveined them. Okay. And this is a very quick recipe for those of you who don't know what you're making. Okay. Have a few ingredients and we're going to be good to okay, go. Okay, this is all quick stuff because prawns doesn't take very long. No, right. prawns take okay. about a minute. So we've got our pan heating up. And you need a, a pan that holds the heat, okay? You don't want to use something where you put your prawns in and the pan gets cold and okay. then your prawns start to boil. And this okay. is olive oil you use so it's I'm a healthy using, option yeah i'm using the cooking olive oil cooking. or just use sunflower oil is also okay. a very good option the All reason right. is you don't want to burn your oil and then your food starts okay. to smell weird okay we're looking at prawns here now i i never really know how to know whether a prawn is a good prawn or whether it's been lying there frozen for weeks so how do we choose how do you okay. know okay prawns that are frozen with the shells on are absolutely fine prawns okay. that are actually the Shell meat the, okay. that are that's frozen and it looks pink not too good. You okay. can smell that already. You I don't need to do already. a lot yeah. to this to get a good meal. And they're okay. delicious. They're plump prawns. They're going to be fantastic. Okay. So and a single layer. Do, how long do you do this for without putting anything in there? About a, this is going to take about a minute and a half to cook. Okay. So we've got some good sea salt sea going salt. in. Okay. At the top. How do we know when these prawns are done? They're turning pinkish already. The tails yeah. and everything are turning. The pink. tails will start to curl. The color okay. completely changes, right. and then you know. So I didn't put the garlic in first okay. because the garlic actually burns. Okay, so garlic is okay on Valentine's Day. Well, the both of you are going to be eating it. But <laughs> okay. if you have a partner that doesn't like garlic, don't put garlic okay. in, in any meals right. because it's a bit unpleasant. Okay, just a reminder that all these uh, recipes are on Facebook. You've given yes. us all your yes. secrets, all right. All Great, right. you can see the colors changing already. Okay. I'm a bit of a messy chef, you must forgive me. No, you must make a mess. I believe that, that that's yes. the true sign <laughs> of a chef. All right, do you want me to stir that while you explain the rest of our ingredients? For okay, us? great. Now, we're going to pop some garlic in. I'll turn those for you. Okay, you, you can see the color is just beautiful. Some it's garlic. That's garlic that you're using. That's fresh okay. crushed garlic. Fresh crushed now, ginger is like nature's aphrodisiac. Okay. So I'm popping in a bit of ginger, ginger. as well. And shellfish as well. I mean, shellfish commonly known as an aphrodisiac. Yes. Right? And I think also on Valentine's Day, it's great to have What's food. That? Green chili. Green chili. Crushed green chili. Crushed okay. green chili. A bit of magic masala. Okay, magic masala. Yudika's magic masala. Yudika's magic okay. masala. Right. And keep stirring. Stir. Keep stirring. Keep stirring. Oof. Okay. Oops, sorry about what that. What is that? Coconut milk going in. Okay. Now, you're not going to make this with sauce. You just want a bit of sauce it to smells coat. Great the prawns, okay? Okay, and how would I Ooh. serve this? It just smells divine. I would serve this as a snack with a little a little fork and you want to encourage con conversation on Valentine's okay. Day. And that's it, Yuveka, that's it, that you're quick. done. Okay. You're done, you're gonna have a bit of coriander going All in. Right. Okay, Oops. the coriander, the magic garnish. The magic garnish. Okay. And right at the end, just chop some coriander. Okay. And I Let just snip them. Let me do that. All right. I, I love chopping up stuff, right? You love chopping up stuff. Fantastic. Okay. And then are you going to tell us now, we'll start with dessert first because that, that needs some, yeah. some work. Dessert before. is a chocolate pot and you can do it with frangelico or chocolate amaretto. Pot. All right. So hazelnut or almond liqueur. Okay. And I'm just going to reach into that microwave okay. and I'll get... Okay, I'll get out of your way. All right. And just get my cho my chocolate that's melted already. So how did you melt this in there? You could do it in a double boiler or in 30 second intervals and about 500 watts. No water or anything required underneath or anything like that? No. Just directly you in the microwave? put some of that into a little bowl maybe or in a plate here. In this plate. Yeah. What, um, what chocolate is that, Yudika? 
dark chocolate okay. or milk chocolate. Use the best quality you can afford or okay. find. Right. I'm using Belgian because... Splurge on Valentine's Day. Splurge, I mean, it's once a year. Splurge. Would you like me to plate this up for you while yeah, you do Yeah, you can do okay. that. That would be fantastic. All right. Tell me, what, what are you adding into that, that chocolate into? Okay, this is going into egg yolks, right? And we've separated two eggs. And we've got the yolk separately and the white separately. Okay. So you're just going to mix that through. And this is for the busy lady or the busy guy okay. who wants to do something impressive but he wants to do it really quick. And egg whites beaten until they... Okay, just plain egg whites? No plain sugar or anything yeah, in there? Yeah, plain egg whites with about three tablespoons of sugar going in. And okay. you pop that through. Have I done this right? I haven't made it very attractive. I'm not very artistic no, that, that way. that's perfect. You can serve okay. this with a lemon wedge okay. and some right. avocado if you want to serve okay. it as a proper starter. All right. You're going to okay. work that through. Can we move this pot, you I'll take, and I'll we can take plug care the, next, the next pot in for me. It's Let right me here. That. Take that for you. Okay. So that's going in and we're whisking away here. You can just see you want the colour uh, to, to turn a bit light. Okay. And last ingredient, what is sorry, that? second last, cream going in. Is that normal fresh cream? Uh, dub, full yeah, cream? full cream, and full fat, fat cream. Well. Full fat. It's all You've full fat, there's no dieting on Valentine's Day. No dieting Day. on Valentine's Day. Because you need your energy. Yep. Okay. <laughs> and you need your energy and a sugar rush How much as well. Frangelico? Uh, as much as you want. As much as you like. Yeah. Okay. Does it not affect the consistency of the chocolate pot if you put in, if it does um, not get too liquidy? I would say about two tablespoons. Okay. All right. right. But you, yeah, you're right. It could affect the consistency. So a nice smooth. You okay. can plug that in for me, darling. Can I plug this in? Okay. Right. There we Let's go. See if I can do this right. If the lights go out, it is. We are on a fault. marathon today, yes, doing three dishes. Well, it's quick because you've got the kids, you've got the <laughs> hubby coming home, and you only get home at four o'clock, so we understand how this all works. All right. Right. So we've got some that's already prepared. And okay. this is, is on. It on. That's on. Okay, and we're going to pop this in to little bowls. Okay, let me take that for mm -hmm. you. That okay. would be fantastic. And this is going to be in Ooh. the refrigerator for about 30 minutes. Okay. So I've also made something that doesn't need to chill overnight. And it's quite simple and easy okay. to make. Right. right. Now we've got some that I've done already. That's what they look like. Oh, that's yummy. Okay. That's very nice. And we're going to pop some chocolate on top, white chocolate. Okay. Can I put that back in there? Yes. All right. And where would you like me to put your prawns? Mm, on the table. On the I table. Think. So we okay, can let's feast have a just look. now. I'm moving over to the table while you're making that all. Okay, so that's what these look like. Okay. They're beautiful. White chocolate on top. And I'm going to pop this here. Yummy. And our next dish, a very, very quick and easy seared fillet. Now, okay. fillet takes just about a minute to cook. You get started with that, and I'll hold on to these prawns for dear life because they smell so good. And then we'll explain <laughs> our table. All right. Okay, great. So this is heating up. I'm just waiting for my pan to heat up. In okay, what steak have we got here? Fillet. Fillet. Is that the best? Is that the best type of... I, I'm a fillet person myself. I'm a fillet person okay. too. You can take buy another cut, but okay. then you get sometimes... It's tender, sometimes it's not. Sometimes you get sinew running through the meat. So it just depends entirely on you. Okay, right. Okay. I'm going to talk about the dressing f for What's a bit. In there? We've got three tablespoons of light soy, one okay. tablespoon of dark soy for color. Okay. So right. light soy gives you the flavor. Okay. We're going to pop some spring onion in here. Okay, spring onion, spring light onion. soy, dark soy. And you All can right. just, and, and there's also a teaspoon of honey in here. Honey. Just to give okay. you the, uh, the sweetness. Okay. Okay. All right, well, if you're not catching all of this, all the ingredients and the recipes are on Facebook. So we'll tell you how to get there and uh, cook that up for this evening. More olive right. oil, the healthy version. The healthy version. Okay. And am, am I right to say that fillet is the tastiest? type of steak more uh, taste i actually no. enjoy a good rum steak from okay. time to time fillet okay. is very tender okay and it's the sure bit okay but right. they are they are they, uh, sometimes i like a sirloin as okay. well but you get this good and bad ones hey? yeah all right this is my favorite okay. reliable so what are we doing here with this we are just going to sear this fillet in okay. a bit of oil you can see there's not a lot of oil in yeah, here yeah not a lot hey? right okay. and the important thing to remember when you are cooking fillet as well is to always let your meat rest. Okay. So you're going to pop it onto some foil okay. and cover it up. Okay. It stays and warm. And it's a very hot pan. First. It's a very hot pan. Okay. I haven't had enough time to heat this up properly. Okay. All right. But that will do. Okay. okay. Just a touch of salt going in because okay. soy does have a fair okay. bit of salt. Okay. Right. So let's do this one quickly so we can just have a look at our table as well. Okay. And now we're going to add some ginger into to our that. soy mixture. Yeah. Right. And some garlic as well. Okay. Just a, so a all touch the aphrodisiacs going in here yeah. today. And all the right. important thing is you can actually serve chili. this as a salad. Your chili okay. going in. 
You can serve this as a salad. Okay. And you can put it on some rockets or something like that. Or you can serve it as with mashed potatoes okay. or stir-fried oh, veggies. Lovely. It's entirely, entirely up okay. to you. Now don't laugh. These are okay. ice tongs, but I have small that's hands. That's fine. That's whatever helps you get a good grip. Okay, so we sear this. We're All searing right. this. All right, and then can we that. leave it in there and then just explain, put, on, put our dressing on and explain what's happening with that beautiful table that you've set up for us. Because I'm clueless. I have no idea <laughs> how to do that. All right. No, great. You the table, yeah, we can leave this for a bit if you want to talk about the table in the meantime. All right, should we just have a mosey on over there? And I'm holding yep. on to these prawns still, as you can see, because no one else is going to get them. All right. <laughs> That's fantastic. All right. So very it's all simple. red. It's all red. You right. can see there's a lovely um, heart-shaped yes. um, casserole as well. So you can get quite fa fancy okay. for Valentine's Day. But I really enjoy laid-back, easy entertaining. You don't yes. want to be knocking things over. Yes, yes. You, know, you don't want to be looking clumsy on Valentine's Day. Of course. Even if you've been married for 10 years, you don't want to be looking clumsy. Yeah, it's like okay, if so it goes bad on Valentine's Day, you kind of feel like... Oh. It's going bad already. <laughs> <laughs> well, have a few glasses of that and it won't matter is what yes, I say. Yes, have, All right. have a blast. Well, you, you've layered very nicely here. Red, white, the red napkins. And of course, yeah. it's very easy to get. Just pop into the shops. Yeah, and there's just, a lot of... Just use your intuition, I suppose. Hey. And I think also the important thing to remember is you don't only have to do this on Valentine's Day. Okay. It's, it's such a treat to have your partner come home and you've made a meal and you've laid the table, which is saying we're in our I'm home, in our comfort zone, and we're having time. our time. All right, let's have a look at that steak and see what's <laughs> going on there. Oh, yes, and don't forget, put the kids to bed early. Non-medicated, of course. No panadas. <laughs> no panadas. <laughs> no panadas. <laughs> no panadas syrup. <laughs> right, right, our steak is We've coming along. We've got seconds to do this, so let's do that. Okay, so you can see it's got a bit of colour. Okay. I would have preferred the, the pan to be have been much hotter. Okay, all right. Okay. But this is going to do fantastically well. Right, a bit of colour on your fillet. Right. And then we're going to pour on that dressing. Can I take that and... Or you yep. can let it rest for a bit. How does this work? You would normally let it rest. Okay, well, let's assume it's rested. We'll assume this is Yes, TV. your meat is happy you and rested. You can hang on to that for me. Okay. She's very cool. She makes me hold all the food. Mm. You can smell Knowing it. Knowing I can't eat it yet. Okay, Not all yet. right. And that's it. We're done. And that's we finished it. We're this. done. Okay, great stuff. All right, let's have a look at that, which is very pretty. Very, very lovely. Would rock it, on, rock it as a salad or mashed potatoes as a main? Now, this is definitely going to go to my man's <laughs> stomach and heart. Thank you very much, Yudika. It's a pleasure. Um, I'm going to try this on, on another day because, you know, it's my, it's my veggie day today. But we'll talk veggie recipes. <laughs> I don't have veggie but day. I will tackle those chocolate <laughs> pots. Now, we've loved our bellies, our babies, and the kids. It's us up next when we learn how to love ourselves, even if it means.